Okay, so here's the seat on my tool chest. And you can see being the passenger seat, these straps are surprisingly still not completely uh, split. They usually split right here where they meet this little metal frame. So let's start pulling it apart. All right, step one, I like to uh, separate the two. So we'll undo this screw here, it's just a cover. And then there's a nut and bolt here on both sides. We'll have to hit that. In fact, I won't, I won't bring it all the way out. We'll just lift it up and then I can get to this nut and bolt. So I don't risk cracking that. Restoration. Make sure you bag and tag everything. Hmm. Now here's an important note. Okay, I took that nut and bolt out. Put it back together here. There is, and there's this plastic cover, there's a washer in between the bottom and, and top piece here. So don't lose that one. And uh, just remember that goes in there. Okay, I flipped it, we're on the side two now. First the plastic cover, loosen it, get it out of the way. Then we'll get to our half inchers. Okay, half inch. So, badly sprained my wrist the other day. I fall a long way down. So dealing with that kind of hurts when I do certain things here. So let me use my right hand. There we go. Hey, there we go. Lock nut. And there's our washer in between. Bolt. And that plastic cover goes over it. Somebody has just greased the heck out of this in there. And as you can see, we're now separated. We'll work on the bottom first. Um, what we'll do is take this cushion off. I hate this part because of these clips here. And it's tough not to damage the, the material, but to get to these straps, we really need to do to take it off. I think I'm just going to replace these, even though none are snapped. They're in pretty bad shape. Fortunately, I think the foam's good. The foam's like 50 bucks. All right, now there's four of these clips across the back. Let's figure out the best way to attack these because they actually go all the way around the material, not just onto the metal. There we go. Voila. So not too much bead on it there. One more to go. You guys have a better way, let me know. There we go, we'll just kind of slide it around now. I'll pick it up here. There we go. 
voila. So not too much bead on it there. One more to go. Okay, now we got them all free. Should be able to pull this off. I'm gonna lose those clips. And there's our original foam. One that was still date stamped. Some vinyl paint, not be too bad. But our phone's in pretty good shape. RH for right hand, right there. And there's the original date stamping 20 uh, December 1976, I believe. Next up, let's pull these guys all out. And then we'll have our frame removed. Now, it gets harder when these straps are actually new. Oh, Chamay. Fake Chamay. Okay, let's document how this goes. There's two clips here. This is the back of the front seat. Clips here, and this vinyl comes around from the back, wraps around, and it's just kind of in there loose then with these two clips. There is one, two, three, four little clips on this back piece, then two. So I'm taking these clips off the back um, with the with an old chisel, actually. You gotta get something under there. And then down. Okay. A metal bar across the back here. Okay, we got that up and off. Um, next up is, there's these screws here, just kind of in there. There's the back adjustment to pull out. So let's do those next. Uh, what we have to do is reach up inside here to be able to get and slide out this headrest um, stop in there. Headrest is pretty stuck up there. Got a metal pole up in there and hitting it upwards. There it comes. And we'll feel it. It's done going up. There. Now I've got a squeeze up in there. So this is what we're dealing with here. I've got I think the headrest has got to come up here and come through this and it has a little push pin on it and I think it's already in this tube now I'm gonna to try to just get it I think it's jammed up all the way in there I'm gonna try to get it out yep it just pulled right out uh, so this was in there and I think these are pretty much Kind of rusted anyway, so it was able to come right out through there, regardless of being stuck in there. Okay. Headrest off. You can just clearly pull up on this piece of cake, right?
Spray this glue on it, but it immediately starts to rust the thing. Old factory tape. Last time this was off, some dude in England, huh? Pretty cool. Okay, let's clean it on. Ooh. There's our rusty frame that I'd like to sandblast. So rusty. Surprised the seat went back at all. Foam's pretty good though. Nice. Boom, 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 boom. Pretty sure the foam, the back, doesn't matter left to right. Ah, that was a mouse. Got a little chewing on. Sheesh. Thank mm -hmm. you.